Howdy, lieutenants and economists. The most volatile, evil, disgusting things on the planet, humans. If you have a video request, you can always go to assholeconsulting.com. Yeah, I am gonna charge you, kids. And that is the importance of not fucking up. You are such an asshole! Castleconsulting.com, go there if you got questions. A young man writes, I'm a 28-year-old software engineer employed at a consultancy. Uh, my company has a fairly, fairly generous tuition reimbursement program, about $5,000 per year, so I've decided to acquire my technical master's degree online while working. I'm planning on spreading the course load over three years, so my out-of-pocket expenses will be limited to about five to 6000 That's nothing, dude. I've applied both to the Master's of Computer Science program at the University of Louisville, and the Master's of Software Engineering program at the University of West Florida. I've been accepted by the former and awaiting a decision from the latter. I have two questions about the situation. Do you think it is even worth getting a Master's? I do have several certifications, but I figure that a terminal technical Master's degree would or could complement the aforementioned certifications and only be beneficial in future professional endeavors. In addition to the potential career benefits, it is also somewhat of a personal goal of mine. I make seventy-five thousand a year with minimal living expenses. Look at that, four forty rent plus. Oh, that's great. So five to six grand out of pocket over the course of three years is not particularly egregious sum of money for me to pay. It is, however, a substantial amount of money in and of itself. Yeah, and it's your time. Um, do I think it's worth? Well, yeah. I mean, if if it's a personal goal for you and it's that cheap. Um, yeah, then it, then it starts to approach hobby world, uh, in which case, if you want to do it, do it. And yeah, there's, it's not like a master's. Even an MBA doesn't hurt you, unless you're applying to a job with me. Then I'm like, fuck you, get your MBA ass out of here. I would never hire an MBA. Uh, but, but I'm one out of 300 million people in the country. But yeah, a master's degree is not going to hurt you. It certainly is not going to hurt you at all. It also opens up the opportunity for you to teach as an adjunct uh, or part-timer. Um, you know, of course, you got to get your doctorate if you want to be a real professor, because obviously you don't know what you're doing with just a master's. Uh, but since it's it's you have ulterior uh, incentives to get it beyond your your career, yeah, I mean it's something to do. Absolutely, you're spreading it out over time. This isn't going to ruin your social life. Uh, it's relatively cheap. So yeah, I think it would be. Normally, I would say, well, you know, if you got family and this and that, is it really worth it? And you know, I, I, you know, you're in IT, why don't you just go get the certifications, blah, 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 blah. But if you want to, this is something you want to do personally, um, and it's more or less paid for, fuck yeah, go for it. If someone paid me to go to college for economics, I probably still wouldn't. Cause I, <laughs> I still, fuck you. Not only would you have to pay my tuition, you'd have to pay me a wage to go to college because it, 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 won't, it won't make a fucking difference. Uh, two, there's a significant amount of parity between the two curricula, so the decision of which degree to pursue boils down to two factors, the title of the degree and the accompanying benefits of one of the degrees. I believe that the degree software engineering would sound better to vacuous, I hope I pronounced that right, HR personnel and hiring manager troglodytes than would the degree in computer science. Yeah, I'd, I'd go with that. Um, I'm also inclined to think that the software engineering is... Well, we'll look it up here in a bit. Let's let's look that up here in a little bit. The computer science degree, however, comes with the benefit of allowing me to select courses in such a way that I would obtain a graduate certificate in data mining, along with the master's without having to take additional courses. With this in mind, which do you think sounds like a better degree to obtain? I already have my thoughts, but I wanted to hear yours. You, I think you're splitting hairs by this time. Um, I Let's look it up. Let's look up what software engineers make. I mean, I'm betting we're talking less than 10 grand difference. Software engineers, BLS. Computer software engineers, ba 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 ba. $101,000 per hour, uh, per hour, 101000 per year on average. And then let's do computer scientists. Don't tell me that's not really what computer science majors do. Shut up. Uh, computer science says, yeah, 111,000. I mean, so you're talking, yeah, typical entry level is doctoral or professional degree. So you're splitting hairs. Um, I would just go with what you think is personally more interesting. Uh, I, I would probably go the software engineering route because that's me. I've, I've enjoyed, now this is, these fucking nerds are, I'm going to tell them not to descend, but I don't mind programming HTML. I know it's not a language. Shut the fuck up. 
but I like the okay, I got that to work. I get the job, the the script to work. I plug it in. Ah, oh, there's my mistake. I figure that's just me. Uh, I I think I like that. Um, but yeah, it's really up to you. You you really are going to be splitting hairs by this time. Your graduate certificate in data mining. I mean, it's the easier route, but yeah, it, it's up to you. I, I really, you're like, do you want a yellow grapefruit or a red grapefruit? I was like, well, what's your favorite color, frankly? Uh, so I, I would not, I, I, me, I'd lean towards the software engineering. Uh, but in the long run, dude, I don't think it's really going to matter all that much for you. On a related note, it sounds as, I know this sounds incredibly bad, which it probably means that it is, but I've also been thinking about getting my master's my MBA after my technical master's. I know that an MBA is a waste of the degree. Then why are you getting it or contemplating these stupid things? The only way it has the potential to be useful is if the degree comes from a top five business school. I'm only considering it because I'm currently interested in transitioning over to management consulting with a specialization in big data. And well, then go with a big data degree. Get your master's in big data. Don't, you don't need the fucking MBA. Basically, I want the bigger pay and the better exit opportunities with a lesser chance of being replaced by cheap foreign labor. I could care less if I'm some incorrigible corporate cocksucker. If I were to start an MBA, I'd probably be around the age of 30, 32. I highly doubt that a wife or children are in my future, so personal factors are under consideration. I am, worried, however, worried about the potential return on investment probability of success for this transition plan. After obtaining my technical master's, would it be worth getting... If you can get into a top five business school, but yeah... But God almighty, dude, how much money do you want to make? You're already talking you're a minimalist, and you're not going to have a wife or kids. Well, how much fucking money do you need? That's the whole point and benefit of being a bachelor and a minimalist, is you don't need to make $100,000, of which 50% goes to the fucking parasites of this country. You, you just, I mean, you, you don't, you can mail it in now. You can sort of coast. I mean, you also have an intellectual interest. You're going to have so much, you're going to have money coming out of your ass uh, with your technical masters. You're not going to have to worry about an MBA. And then if all of a sudden, look, here's here's what I do. If the company you're working for says, we'd really like you to get an MBA, after you get your master's, say, yeah, okay, then I'd like to see some tuition reimbursement and compensation for my time. But yeah, if, if you could get into Harvard MBA, fine, or Chicago, or Wharton, I mean, it's not going to hurt you, but how much money do you want to make? I mean, are you getting laid? Are you playing sports? Are you having some fun? So that's, I, postpone that. Just just wait till you get your master's. See how the land settles afterwards and then then see if it's worth your time to get that MBA. But right now, don't, just get your master's and whichever one you want for the technical degree and hold off on that MBA. So anyway, hope that helps. Best of luck to you. Toodles.